I'm not I'm not sure about this this Tinkerbell class. Well, it's it's on our list. We gotta go no matter what. <sighs> Don't wear your backpack down. You have to put it in a shelf or something, Olaf. I'm putting it in the shelf. Olaf, can huh? you be gentle? I'm trying. Man, you can't do anything right. Never guess not. Hey, here we got new desks. How do you know? I heard the teacher down the hall saying that everybody in the whole school, all the teachers, got brand new desks. They're different than our old ones. Can't wait to see them. Wow. Oh, wow. Wow, wow, wow. Should put that down, Benjamin, get to class. Uh-uh-uh. Guess one more and one more. Guess one more one more. And then I'm in class. Yeah. Hey, don't let the teacher know what I know all by herself or off. When it's time for school, you do not use these things ever. Now get into class, sit down, and I better not have no trouble out of you after this. You're already off on a bad foot. You're starting wrong. Uh, Benjamin always does wrong things. Well, then he, it's time he gets written up and maybe even sent home and expelled from school. And maybe he'll have to uh, retake the whole year over again. We're not going to tolerate that kind of thing from nobody. Start the whole year? Well, believe me, if you keep doing the things you're doing, you're going to. Uh, I'm here. Oh, here I am. And I know that you can see the playground from the window, but I don't want anybody being distracted by stuff like that or what's going on outside because I really don't want to close those curtains because it would be like stuffy in here. Do you hear me? How do you kids like your new desks? Uh, they nice. They just, they just arrived this morning. Uh, what can we call you? We even had the walls. Call me uh, Miss Samantha, because that's my real name. Oh, hi, Samantha. All right, let me uh, do roll call. Uh, Catboy. I'm here. I barely fit in my chair. Uh, Olaf. I'm here. Elsia. Uh, mm, I'm here. Snowboy in her yellow hat. Uh, I'm here, but my name is Simon. Okay, Simon. Here. Uh, John Henry. Here. Huh? Anya. Anya. Here. Noe. Here. S uh, uh, my name is, uh... You forgot? Yeah, it's Keith. <laughs> <laughs> Keith? Alright, Benjamin, I know you. You're the one that's going to be repeating the year over, probably. Oh, snow girl. Yeah. Uh, I'm here. I want to be good for this whole new year. Alrighty, that's good. Uh, Christopher. Here. And. Bacor. Bacor. Here. Alright, now that you're all here, we're going to learn about something very fascinating. We are going to learn. No, we're going to learn something very fascinating, and here it is, an acorn. Now, what are we going to learn about acorns? Does anybody know? Uh, about acorns, uh, squirrels love them. Squirrels do love them. We're going to learn about where acorns come from. Of course, trees. I ain't stupid. Uh, okay, Olaf, we don't need to uh, talk like that. So I know what kind of tree? Uh, Cat boy. A uh, I forgot what this trees are called. Uh, like the great elf tree. Uh, what is the great elf tree? Uh, the one in uh, Van Hoys of the Kingdom. I forgot what they called. Uh, sit back. And relax. And relax, and I'll tell you where acorns come from. <laughs> the acorn is a fruit of an oak tree. Can't believe I forgot that simple word. You know how long it takes an oak tree to bear fruit? I don't know. Is it, nobody knows? Yes. 1,000 years? It takes 100 years for an oak tree to start bearing fruit because trees age different than people. So an old tree or what would seem like to be an old tree to you guys would actually be young 
to a tree. Those trees age so slowly. A lot of them, but some trees age fast. And don't go out there and quote me and say, Oh, though my teacher said our trees age slow because some don't. And uh, an acorn is a nut. It has a single seed. But sometimes you find one that's a little bit mutated, it'll have two seeds. What, that's like my mom? A nut and has two seeds? Man, you better believe it. <laughs> See, I can joke. The acorn is enclosed in a tough, leathery shell. Acorns vary from 1 to 6 centimeters long and 0 0.8 to 4 centimeters broad. Acorns take, but take between about 6 to 24 months, depending on the species of tree, to mature. So there you go. It takes anywhere from 6 to 24 months. Now 24 months is 2 years. 6 20? months is half a year. 24 months? But so that's 2 years, right? Yeah, 24 months. It's 2 years. 12, two years. 12 months is a year. But so, some acorns mature in only 6 months. That's only a half of a year. So uh, you plant an acorn tree at the first month. No, they bear fruit that long. The acorn tree is an, the acorn comes from an oak tree. It takes 100 years for the oak tree to start bearing fruit. But they are ripe and ready to eat within six months to two years according to the species of oak tree. Oh, I really hope I remember And you that. could actually make decorations with acorns. You yeah, could, you could put a hole in them. Yeah, and you could put it, take the top off and use them as a hat <laughs> on some stuff if you want to do that. If you're uh, gifted enough to know such things. Acorns are one of the most important wildlife foods in areas where oaks grow. Creatures that make acorns an important part of their diet include birds, such as blue jays and pigeons, some ducks, and several species of woodpeckers. Small animals that feed on acorns include mice, squirrels, and several other rodents. Such large animals are also that eat them are pigs, bears, deer, also eat large amounts of acorns. They, uh, Con constitute up to 25% of the diet of deer in the autumn. See, that's big. In some of the larger oak forests in the southwest Europe, traditionally called the Hossus, pigs are still turned loose in oak groves in the autumn to fill and fatten themselves with acorns. So you see the acorns are serve many animals in the forest where, where oak trees grow. They're very delicious. They're not poisonous. They're very good to eat, and they're healthy. Anybody have any questions about the acorn? Uh, everybody can eat them? Everybody can eat acorns, but they are a nut. Now, I'm not sure if, because some people have allergies to nuts, you may want to check your doctor or something if you've never eaten acorns before to see if it's okay. But I think that it would be, but like I said, ask your parents first and see what they think, because it is a nut. Uh, um... I hear Mario in the other classroom. Luigi, get your milkshakes made, and if you make any mistakes with it, mess it up, I'm gonna smack your brains out, Luigi. So if you mess Mario, up, my... what? The camera here. <laughs> like I was saying, Luigi. Well, I'll just ignore Mario. But I will tell you this: acorns do contain tannins, which are toxic to some animals. That's why you need to ask your parents before you eat acorns. I eat Maybe acorns a lot. Yeah, yeah uh, some animals they're toxic too because tannin is a toxin to some animals such as horses. Uh, but but tannins can be soaked out by soaking the acorns in water. They can get soft? Well, they don't really get soft, but they take out if you soak them in water to take out the tannins so they'll be safe to eat. Hot or normal? Normal water. It's just tap water room temperature. Just soak them in there. The tannins will get stuck to the water? Yep, they come out of the water. Then take the acorns out and dry them off. Good. Of course with a cloth or a kitchen paper towel, anything like that. Just dry them off. I use my dog, as she said, every day. <laughs> yeah, your dog. Let him lap them dry. Uh, John Henry, what did you learn about the acorns so far? Uh, I kind of like acorns. Class. Yeah, uh, but what did you learn? Uh, 
Tell me something that I said about acorns. Uh, you use tap water to get all the, forgot the name already. Uh, tannins. Tannins out for the acorn. Uh, can you name at least one animal that eats acorns? Mm, dogs. Well, I guess a dog could eat an acorn, but what animals that live in the forest eat acorns? Squirrels. Yeah, you're right. Squirrels, bears, deers, woodpeckers. Squirrels is the number one thing that I know who eats acorns a lot. But yeah, that's because squirrels live around here a lot. We're used to a lot of squirrels hanging around. So, uh, anybody else have any questions about acorns before I go on? No, no. Never in my whole entire life. I never gonna ask any questions. Well, then how about take the class over next year and then you can learn to ask questions. Do you like that? No, no. I don't want to take the class over, no, over a new year. Okay. I'm already eight years old. Alright, name an animal then that eats acorns. Well, you can't say something that another kid's already said. Bears. Absolutely right. Bears eat acorns. We're talking about acorns, but acorns do come from an oak tree. So what? El what actually can you do with an oak tree? Uh, what you can do with an oak tree? I don't know. Like but Christopher. Me? Hmm. Uh. Make decoration with them. Cut them up. You can make decorations with them if you cut them up, but oak trees are often used to make furniture because oak is a long-lasting long hard wood and <coughs> uh, excuse me, class, and wood-boring insects are usually turned off by the taste of oak trees, much like uh, mahogany. They're also turned off from mahogany because of its bitter taste. Termites or anything woodworm won't mess with a red mahogany tree. Um. Yes, cat boy. Oh, please, I like mahogany. Well, they are in the way that the insects are turned off to them. But if oak gets so old and so dry, they may attract the insects. Uh, like my grandma? <laughs> yes, like your grandma. Was she an insect? Uh, yes, and a lot of people are attracted to her. Why she's still sexy and young looking? Why she's 60 years old? Well, some people age very good. Now, acorns also include, they can help you if you eat them, because they give like you... Like medicine! Yeah, they give you vitamin A. Vitamin B, vitamin C, vitamin B, every kind of vitamin. Yeah, they give you a lot of vitamins. They also, they say they also help you fight cancer and help purify your body. So, if you can eat some, and they, they taste really good. I've eaten a lot of acorns. Because so, you're a fairy. Yeah, I'm a fairy, that's it. So, any of you kids that like to eat acorns, maybe there's some oak trees somewhere around here. We live in oak tree territory. I don't know how many there are, but uh, maybe I'll try to find some acorns and bring them in sometime so you kids can eat. Do any of you kids uh, know how to do crafts with acorns? Uh, yes, yes. Um, get the acorn and, um... Uh Make uh, some quiz with them. Cut the acorn in half. Yeah, you can do quite a bit with acorns, kids. And uh, remember, class is almost over. And you remember what I said about acorns. And to make sure you did re did do try to remember, excuse me, kids, about acorns. Tomorrow we're actually going to have a quiz on acorns. So be prepared, everybody. And uh, also, we're going tomorrow, we're going to do... Hold on. <laughs> what? How? I, I was Get screaming. Up. I was worrying about acorns. Yeah, I bet you was. So don't be sleeping in class. Uh, I just woke up too early. You go to bed. Well, you go to bed earlier. So you bed earlier at night so you can get a better night's sleep. Well, what are you doing at night? Uh, playing video games, uh -huh. uh, playing with toys, having a midnight mm. snack well, with play, my brother and sister. Well, playing with toys is fine, but stay away from those video games so much. Devote only a very short period of time to video games a day. <coughs> Excuse me. And I hope not. <laughs> and devote the rest of your time with running and playing and getting exercise and things. Watch me. I'm Max. 
Mm. Olaf. Take a sec. Go! Olaf. Olaf, get back here. This is not recess. Oops. I'm, I'm going to write, make a write up slip on you. Pick that up at once. I can't pick up the table. Wait, let me see. Oh, it's mahogany, but it's kind of easy. I'm giving you a write-up sleep, Olaf. Now here it is. I want your parents to sign it, both of them. Put them here. All right, now come over here and sit down on your desk. I can't finish this. Oh yes, I forgot. Go ahead, hurry up and put that up. What's going on? Uh, there's a bug on you. Uh, I don't care. I got it on. That's fine. And your wings. Ask your parents when you go home what kind of fur what kind of uh, wood is your furniture made of. If they know, they may not know, but if they know you may be surprised about it. It may be made out of oak. <sighs> Alright, class is over. Olaf! <laughs> class is over. You kids can go now and remember <coughs> what I said about acorns. Mm -hmm. I won't forget to tell my mom and dad if we have flame children that's made out of oak. Alrighty. And don't forget about uh, what I said. And don't forget also we're going to have an acorn quiz tomorrow. It's going to be 10 questions. I'm going to ask you about acorns. But we forget because it's such a well, long time. Well, if you forget, tomorrow's a long time. Yeah, if we have a lot of hours of sleep. <laughs> but if you forget, then I guess you'll fail the quiz. They're going to be simple questions. Alright, kids. Now... Jay, I, I know. Are I you just, okay? Yeah, I just tripped over the edge of the desk. All right, kids, you can go now. Look how close it is. I know. You can go now and have a nice day and a nice evening, and I'll see you kids tomorrow. Man, Ooh, I, I had a know. wait up slip. No. All right. I didn't know the acorns was healthy like that. There's an acorn, there's actually an acorn tree in the back of my house. It gets, <gasps> and so when you're sick, you can get all those vitamins from an acorn. I, mean, I sure can. I'll suck those acorns <laughs> like a lollipop. They ain't you. you. You can suck an acorn. You eat them. Well, whatever you do to an acorn, I'll be the one doing it. Yeah, me too. You got acorns. You should share them. They, they give a lot of fruit. Yeah, they give a lot of... We got a nuts. I'm not eating a fruit. <laughs> they give a lot of nuts. Wow. I kind of. I need a line about acorns tonight. I got a line about them. Well, we can eat. We can quiz each other. Uh, yeah. What animals eat acorns? Berries. What else? Uh. Pigeons. Pigeons. Pigeons eat acorns. Woo! Tell you a pigeon. Uh, uh, sometimes. Um. But I'm also a cat, so I chase myself. <laughs> Your tail, baby. Uh -huh. Man, can you believe it? Man, I, I like acorns after that. Especially that big picture that she printed so we can see it real good. Even a blind kid could see an acorn like that. Man, she's going to quiz us tomorrow. I hope I don't forget what I learned about acorns today. You have to write it on a piece of paper? Yeah, you can learn it any way that you can and remember it any way you can. Let's just talk about them. Be easier. No, it's going to be a written quiz tomorrow. A written quiz. I got your wine. That's it for this show. We hope you learned something about acorns. And we hope to see you next time on All About Sierra. And hit the like button, subscribe, share, and do all sorts of stuff like that so you know when the next video is coming. And we'll see you next time. So, goodbye. Wait, Spencer's going to do something. Well, I'm going to the bathroom. So, you wait on me because I'm going to say something at the end too. Alrighty. Well, I guess the video's not ending that qu quite that fast. Teacher, teacher, he's still on the tablet. Go ahead, push that back right now. You're getting a second write up slip. No, 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 can we see the way to slip? They better be both signed. Like, all right. Oh, I've only got one. How about I got two? 
I said shut up. All right, people, we're going to get out of here, and we'll see you next time. Goodbye.